The HTML editor integrates with all learning environment tools that have the HTML content creation capabilities. For example, the HTML editor is available when you edit discussion topics, create custom instructions for drop boxes, or just create content topics. Note, this tutorial will show you will show inserting an image within a module file. Inserting an image can be added to any content that has the HTML editor available such as Dropbox directions, Dropbox feedback, quiz questions, quiz feedback, etc. Anywhere the HTML editor exists, this is how you add an image. Within, so you want to click on the location of where you want to put the, H, the image. You click on the image icon, insert image icon. So you have two choices now. If the file has not been uploaded to the Manage File area, in other words, the file is on your computer, you go through these steps. Click Upload. And then what you want to do is locate the file on your computer. You want to click on that file, the file name. Click Open. The file will upload. Click Add. The Provide Alternative uh, text will will show up. You want to put in a um, some alternative text information that would be descriptive of the image and the reason for this is that this is read by screen readers for students with visual disabilities. Click OK and the image is added. The second process is if the image is already in the Manage File area. So we click on the Insert Image, we click Course Offering Files, you're now going to locate the uh, image within the Manage Files area. You're going to click on the radio button next to the name of the image that you want to uh, use. Click Add. Again you'll get the alternative text. Put in some alternative text, click OK, and the image gets inserted.